buy up here today and by popular demand today is the day that i will make a keybinds video for destiny 2 um i've been playing pc um destiny 2 for a bit and i came from console myself and i came from using a scuff controller and i wanted to make a quick video explaining my keybinds since today is the day that uh everything's happening and my chat is being a bitch Ugh! um anyway Moving forward, the number one thing I want to say and point out is if you are using, if you're coming from console, switching to PC, either Xbox or PS4, and you're using a scuff controller or an elite controller or a scuff elite controller or a whatever you're using, I honestly believe there is nothing wrong with using a controller, especially a scuff, with the paddles on the back uh, for multitasking, which is perfect. It's flawless. I, there's nothing wrong with using. A scuff especially on pc so i want to put that out in your head right now because i i don't regret switching to mouse and keyboard it's good to learn it so i can play other games as well but there's no reason not to just play on your controller on pc it's actually still really good um and it's gonna feel better than it felt on ps4 or xbox anyway because of the frame rate it actually feels like uh it's working better it feels really really good controller feels amazing on PC. Some of the best players play on controller on PC, including Ogre and possibly Drewski or Old Man Mikowski, I think. There's a lot of people that are very, very good and play on controller. LeClear, for example, um, One Second Kill. All these controller players, they're top notch. Every single person I just mentioned is probably better than me, and they all play on controller. So, I wanted to get that out first. Now, if you are playing on mouse and keyboard, and you want some keybinds because you really don't know what's going on. Um, I feel like the default keybinds are hot garbage. And I don't think you should use them that way. Um, I used a combination of keybinds from other streamers that I've met. Um, including Tifu and Giggs actually. And some other people. And then since then they've evolved and turned into some weird mess. Uh, but me personally, I don't like to use one, two, three, and four um, because I come from a scuff controller and I don't like to move any fingers off of the directional buttons unless I have to. Uh, so I do my best to to be able to do that. So as we as we go down, obviously you use WASD for movement. Um, I have emote one, two, three, four set to one, two, three, four. That's what I use one, two, three, four for. And then obviously push to talk is T, orbit is O. I don't know if that's default or not. I don't have screenshot, but uh, this is where we get to the nitty gritty. So fire is obviously click, reload, obviously R. I set, so I use a Logitech G703 mouse. And as you can see here, I'll even make it big for you. It has two buttons on the side and that's it. It's the normal standard uh, mouse layout, two buttons on the side. This one's for DPI. So you don't actually get to play that, um, but you get two buttons on the side. So my back mouse button, so which would be the farthest back one, I have set to melee. That way I can aim and melee exactly where I want to without taking any fingers off of any uh, movement buttons, without taking any fingers off of anything. Um, I feel like melee is super important. Um, obviously hold right click to zoom. I don't have toggle zoom because I'm not a weirdo. Um, and then for some reason it goes straight into light attack. So light attack is default to just click. My heavy attack for some reason defaulted to my melee, which is the back mouse button and blocking is right click. Jump is obviously space. Um, and then toggle sprint is shift. Toggle crouch, I use the left control. Uh, class ability, I use alt because it's right next to the jump. Um, I literally, I just take my thumb and I pull it over and I just click alt. Boop, 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 boop. Super easy. And I just spilt freaking shit all over my anything. Okay, moving forward. We're gonna clean that up <laughs> later. Uh, air move is C. I don't really use air move. I'd probably change this if I used it. Um, and then F is interact because I come from PUBG as well. Grenade is the front mouse click button. If that makes any sense to you. Um, and then super is X. My kinetic and energy, this is where it gets weird. So my primary or kinetic weapon is actually Q and my energy weapon is E. That way I always have kinetic energy right there at my fingertips and it's super easy, super quick to switch between. 
Um, and my power weapon is actually clicking in the mouse wheel, clicking it straight down. And that seems to be the most effective way for me to do it. Um, all these vehicle weapons and stuff, like I didn't really set any of these. I, don't, I honestly don't really care. Like the only thing I need to pay attention to is for some reason my secondary weapon fire is E. And now I know. Uh, but for a long time, I didn't even know that was the thing. So uh, there you have it. The most important ones are where you put your weapons. Uh, just make sure wherever you put them, you know where to put them and you can access them easily. On top of that, grenade and melee are two very common uh, buttons to use. That and class ability, they should be probably on your easiest buttons to press, whatever they are. If for some reason you really like pressing one, two, and three, make make one, two, and three. If those are your e most easily accessed buttons, make those your most important assets. That makes any sense. So there you have it. You can do whatever you want with it. Um, try not to spill bang on your own uh, keyboard. I highly recommend to avoid that because it makes it shitty. But there you have it. So uh, make sure you guys subscribe to the channel and check out my Twitch channel where I'm most likely live right now. See you there.